is up guys welcome back to the channel thanks for clicking on this video and if you're new go ahead and check out all my videos and my playlist and if you like what you see hopefully you stick around long enough to subscribe to this channel and of course help this channel grow today's Tuesday I was expecting a package to come in this Friday but it actually came in early I ordered it off of walmart.com I know the prices on there are super inflated uh, I believe it's because they use different distributors or different sellers for certain casts and stuff that you buy online so uh, a lot of the Hot Wheels you'll see especially like treasure hunts and all that stuff will be super inflated on there I believe like these go for probably like 14 to 20 bucks I've seen some supers that I have go for like 60 to 100 dollars on walmart.com which is insane I don't know how they work let me know down below if you know more about how the online Walmart works versus the in-store stuff but I did buy one cast and I've been wanting it for a while but it's just one of those casts that you're not gonna see in stores you might find them at a swap meet a flea market or something like that or you trade it with somebody uh, but it came in this package I'm gonna blur my address out because I don't want you guys stalking me and checking out all my other casts uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and open this for you so you can check out what I bought let's open this up alright got my little invoice right here and boom there it is it's the 2008 Tesla Roadster and it actually came in a hard case. I wasn't expecting that. I thought it was just going to come in just the box uh, and being carded and all that. But man, this is in really good shape. Uh, let me take it out. There we go. Look at that. Super nice. Now I know there's two variations. There was one with the Starman. They call him Starman. That sits in the driver's seat. This one is not that variation. Let me know down below what the purpose of that is, if it was the first one that came out with the Starman, or if this was the first one and the second one came out. I don't know which one came first, but I still think it's a really cool car to have in your collection. Uh, it's something that you're not going to see in stores because a lot of collectors just scooped them up. A lot of the scalpers bought 30 at one time and sold them online for crazy prices. Um, but I think it's pretty cool, the first car to orbit the sun. Uh, and I looked at the updates the other day and I believe it shows some basic facts back here but they are way further than 5 million miles away now then I know they changed the estimated date that we're gonna be able to see it from Earth because they recalculated the trajectory and how it's orbiting uh, and they found a better method of tracking it and I think it's sooner than 2073 I think it's like 2054 or something like that but yeah I think it's just really cool it comes in a nice um, deep red it's not a metallic it's just a deep red um, it does have some type of like paint perfection it almost looks marbleized uh, it's kind of weird but it's got the RA6 wheels in black uh, and it does have some clear headlights so it doesn't need tampo work it's got the clear headlights uh, and then it's got the Tesla badge up front it's got the lower grille that connects to the base all smooth base of course it's an electric car um, and then it's got some subtle tampo work on the back. It's got these silver accents for the tail lights. It says Tesla right there on the little deck lid. Um, and then it's got a, see if the light can get it, a black wing and a black style bar that goes right over that back window, which it does have a small plastic window, black interior, and it's got some black tampo work for the hood. Um, but yeah, I just always thought it was cool because it's it's a historical car. A lot of people may not really think about it or just really look into it, but there's a legit car flying around space right now, and I, I just think that's really, really cool. If you haven't checked out any of the videos, they actually have live feeds on YouTube. You can watch it um, orbiting. It's actually pretty cool. I'm glad they actually put it in this hard case. I'm not too huge on being a perfectionist on how the card if it has soft edges or if it's super straight but I'm glad they put that in there kind of a little bonus but not bad for I think it was, I paid like 997 uh, and it came in almost a full week early from California so yeah guys hopefully you enjoyed the video if you did give it a thumbs up and of course let me know what you think of this car don't forget to stay tuned till Friday this Friday is gonna be a free at Friday I know last Friday I kinda of fell off on that one and I do apologize um, but I will have something to open up for you guys so I can do another review. Until next time, this is the Mustang Hunter. Peace.